Hey everybody. So one of my children is over in Israel right now, Matty, and he had a Berditcher Verebi moment. Berditcher Verebi moment. Who was the Berditcher Verebi? He lived in the late 1700s. He was a Hasidic master. And he was famous for being an attorney on behalf of the Jewish people. He would always point out to God the positive of Kalal Yisrael, of the Jewish people, no matter what they were doing. So a famous story that's attributed to him is it was Shabbos, and he sees a young man who's smoking on Shabbat, and he goes up to him and he says, maybe you're not aware that it's Shabbat. And the guy goes, no, I know it's Shabbos. I know, it's, I know what the day is. And he says, well, maybe you're not aware that you're not supposed to be smoking on Shabbat. And the fellow says, no, I'm quite aware that you're not supposed to smoke on Shabbos. Whereupon the British Rebbe says, he looked heavenward and said, Lord of the universe, see the holiness of your people. They'd rather declare themselves sinners than utter a lie. He could always find that positive angle for our people. It's also reputed, he said, if after I pass away, I have the option of being alone in Gan Eden, alone in paradise, or to go to Gehenna purgatory, but be in the company of other Jews, I would certainly choose the latter, as long as I'm together with other Jews. This was his Ahavat Yisrael. This was his love of his fellow Jew. So getting back to my son, what was this Berditcher Verebi moment he had? So he, he's in Tel Aviv. He's in an Airbnb, and he hears this loud commotion and noise, and he looks outside his window, and he sees one of the protests that are going on in Israel. Here's the video that he sent us. <laughs> And so, what he says after he sends this video, which was very interesting, he goes, everyone in this country loves it. People in Israel love Israel. And he noted, look how many flags there are at this protest. And we've seen pictures of them, and it's all over the press. Tons, thousands and thousands of Israeli flags at many of these protests. Now, let's face it. Most of these protests going on about the judicial system and the Supreme Court, I'm not going to get into that issue right now, but the way Netanyahu wants to overhaul it and such, most of the protests are by the so-called left wing of Israel. And what my son pointed out was, imagine if you had the left wing protests in America. How many American flags would you see? Would you see one? The American flag is associated with conservatives, with the right wing. America is systemically racist. We don't stand for the national anthem. We bow and uh, get on our knee during the national anthem. But in Israel, the so-called left loves the country. No matter what strain of type of Jew is in Israel, they love Israel. The flags testify how much they love Israel. Israel, how much it means to them, how much they're hurt by what might go on. And so it's a, it's a fantastic insight that my son had. It's a Berditcher Verebi insight that no matter what type of Jew, religious, not religious, right wing, left wing, whatever spectrum they're on, it makes no difference. They love Israel. We love our fellow Jews. When a Jew gets hurt, we're there. We're there to support them. So we don't have Berdichever, the Berdichever Rebbe anymore in our day and age, but we do have insights like this that my son pointed out that show that hopefully go heavenwards where Hashem sees it, where we appreciate it, and we come together as one people, one family, despite whatever disagreements we might have. Have a good Shabbat.